All right, so this next video, very maybe one of the most important videos we posted because you see all the videos we post and shouting out San Joaquin Valley transparency for always finding great videos, watching cops, filming cops, holding them accountable, and all of that good stuff. Just got to take a dab because people think that we hate cops and, you know, shut the fuck up, don't talk to cops, but that's just your Fifth Amendment right. It's your constitutional right. That's what we're talking about. But it's just as important to shine a light and show that there are good cops out there doing good things. And these auditors, people who pick up their cameras, aren't just filming police to show the bad side. They don't know what's going to happen. They just pick up a camera. They see the cops and they say, oh, let's see what's going on. Now, this next video is not a lot of action. There's no violence. There's no cussing. It's just somebody really seeing, hey. Cop pulled somebody over, let me get my camera out and see what's up. These cops that are being filmed appear to do everything that they're supposed to do properly, not giving anybody any hassles, just doing their job the way they're supposed to. Protecting the community, policing the community for safety, giving a traffic ticket when that's what's warranted. So showing these this type of video is just as important. So please check it out. Thanks, San Joaquin, for finding another one. Depths of transparency. Check it out. Encounter this guy's had with police. This guy also has a channel called Depths of History. If you guys recognize this channel, it's because I've shared a couple of his videos and he does outstanding work. Recently, Britton from Depths of History has become a close friend of mine. He's going to be coming up to visit me soon. We're going to be doing some cop watching. I'll go out and do some magnet fishing as well. But check this video out, folks. His first cop watch. Welcome back to Depths of Transparency. My name is Britton, and today I'm going to be talking about my recent experience after I walked outside. I walked outside and I noticed that somebody was being asked to get out of their car. You alright, man? And in the end, their car ended up being impounded, and I walked up to them to see if they were okay and if their rights had been violated. Yep, they're towing the car. We got police on scene with a. Uh, there's an officer over here. Not sure what the reason is, but just making sure he respects their rights and. I want to make sure everything's okay. So it looks like they're going to be... Are they towing the vehicle or not? I don't know. I don't know what the whole story is about this. Tow truck driver's coming around now to see if they need to impound the vehicle. There's the vehicle over there. They just searched. They're talking to him now. All right, simple ticket from the looks of it. Cars and leave. <laughs> yeah, oh, I guarantee you they'll yeah. get in their cars and leave. Probably. Station blast in that cop car. He got a ticket and was sent to his car. We're not interfering with their investigation at all. We're just on the side, public sidewalk. And we want to make sure, you know, because there are police officers that uphold their oath to the Constitution. These both of these officers seem like they've they know what the law is and they are understandable about the law. And that's definitely important. How's it going, sir? Hey, how are y'all doing? Doing well. It's a nice day, isn't it? It's a very nice day. Okay. <laughs> Looks like they're talking to them now. <laughs> I'm assuming like his license was expired or something.
I guess he's just gonna drive it onto the tow truck. Yeah. Looks like they're laughing and smiling. Cobb County Police Department has been a very professional police department, so. I'm glad, I'm glad it worked out. Yeah, I'm glad, it, I'm glad yeah. everything worked out okay. Yeah, everything seems fine. And guys, we just happened to see this as we were coming back and I wanted to stop by and say, hey, wanted to make sure. I think that was like, oh, a pistol. Oh yeah, they took a gun out of the car. Yeah. All right. Looks like the officers didn't even want to have a word with us. But that is about it for this traffic stop. Everybody's gonna be going on their way. <laughs> Cops just staring at us over there, seeing what we're doing. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Have a good You as well. You look pissed. All right, they're leaving now. Let's go talk to them. Everything that's going on. So we just want to make sure they were respecting your rights and everything that y'all were doing. And, and of course, yeah, definitely. Can I shake your hand? Yes, of course. Oh, that's good. Yeah, usually Cobb County has been, oh, they've had a lot of good officers in their division. So. Yeah. Seems like they've been good, but we've had a couple. It's just been like, it's yeah, been crazy. Man. Situations for sure. All right, well, you guys have a good rest of your day. Just glad you guys are all right. Thank right. you awesome. again. Thank you. Since I've started recording police, I've gotten comments like, you're just a police hater and you must be a criminal. Just because you record police, that doesn't mean you're a criminal or you hate police. Britton, over at Depths of History, has many encounters with police officers. He recently helped solve a 16-year-old case when he dove underwater and found a car that belonged to a woman that had been missing for quite some time. This man does outstanding work. The other day, a police officer told him that he doesn't realize how much good he's doing in the world. After talking to Britton at Depths of History, I told him how much I appreciated his work. And since we've been talking, he decided to create a new channel because he does have many encounters with police officers. And while talking to him, he came up with the name Depths of Transparency and asked me what I thought about it. You guys, my channel was the first transparency channel regarding First Amendment audits and cop watching. So when he asked me if it would be okay to use that word in the channel name, I told him he could most definitely have my blessing. With that being said, I would also like to bless him with the court of public opinion and the true support that you guys have given me since day one. I'd like to see you guys all go subscribe to his channel. In January, Britain's coming down to record with me, so you guys get ready for that. All right, guys, have yourselves a blessed day. We'll see you guys in the next video. There's a reason this channel exists. That reason is you. You want to see videos of people who know their rights. Will you learn something if you subscribe and binge watch my videos? My guess is yes. My comment section is full of people thanking me for the videos I post. But many of you contribute to the success of this channel. Some of you help out in the comment section with knowledge and case law. Many of you will ultimately pick up a camera and do some recording as well. I get sent videos daily for me to look at or review. Police interaction videos are blowing up the internet. Understanding law is so difficult that police officers, sheriff's deputies, nor state troopers are required to know the laws. They are out enforcing policies, stepping over people's human rights protected by the constitution, and that's why we have these types of videos. So I would like to encourage you to subscribe to my channel. If you ever find yourself in a police interaction, always record. I believe this channel will help you understand what you can do to protect yourself. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss any of the videos.
just to, to quickly wrap that up, you know, those cops looked like they were doing their job, doing good things, but we'll never know. Maybe they only did that because the cameras were on. Hopefully not, but when they know the cameras are running and they're being held accountable, just the thought, you're out there, you see something happening, pick up your phone, start filming the police.